So when you look at the clinical research for a CPM, the idea is across the board, it is true, everybody doesn't need one, only a small minority would benefit from one. But the fact that you fall into the category of needing a manipulation, having the excessive stiffness, um, I would, as like a patient advocate, I would say you absolutely should be asking, okay, I understand you don't do a CPM for everyone. I understand you don't do it after the initial surgery, but now this is a manipulation situation. I would like to check insurance coverage for a CPM. Medicare still covers it. Now I know you don't have Medicare, but as you know, kind of the gold standard, if Medicare covers it, other payers may cover it, especially after a manipulation. So I'm with them. I don't think everybody should get one. I think that, you know, there's no real advantage, but we just had another patient who had two manipulations from the same group. I don't think it was the same surgeon, but I don't remember. She got a CPM. She loved it. She felt like it made all the difference in the world. She used it for the first two weeks. Uh, I would reach back out to the office today and just say, hey, you know, can you call my insurance? Can you verify if in fact they would cover it after a manipulation under anesthesia? And, and if you don't, you know, if they won't do it, then you can call your insurance company and see if they'll cover the utilization of a CPM after an MUA.